Now, Kenya and Uganda have long enjoyed good trade relations. But in Busia, at the border of the two countries, Kenyan traders have taken the relationship a notch higher, finding handsome returns while shunning business environment back home. Dennis Latiano reports. Busia border, the town that connects Kenya to Uganda. Each side of the border claims the name. It is the epicenter of Kenya and Uganda trade. Business is booming with pub operators taking alliance share of the trade here. Interesting to note, close to 90% of the pubs here are owned by Kenyans. But what drives them across? In Uganda, yeah, it's so cheap to run a bar business, as you don't need a lot of farmers as compared to, to Kenyan side. In the last budget, Kenya slapped a 15% excise duty on wines and spirits manufacturers. This led to an increase of about 20 shillings on alcoholic beverages. Consequently, many Kenyans are now crossing the border to Uganda in a bid to get their favorite alcoholic drinks, which are retailing at half the price. Kopoa, pombe yunua 80 bob. Pombe yunua 180. Satu kikuja huku at least uneza save pesa ingine kiasi, ukiwa biashara, halapu pesa ingine, uneka kwa matumizi ingine. So why is Uganda attractive? Uganda government has provided very good uh, entry investment uh, registration process. Simple to register company takes one day. First thing that we must address for Kenyan business before they go to Uganda is cost of land, cost of labor, and cost of materials. While small businesses have been loaded as the key to turning around Kenya's economy, it seems we still have a lot to learn from the neighbors. Denis Otieno, Citizen TV.